Hello everyone, and welcome to We Happy Few. So, I uh, thought this game looked a little interesting. I saw it way back, I don't even remember when, way back when, when it was like first kind of revealed, and I was like, that looks odd. I had no idea what it was about, just uh, saw these people with weird masks tripping out on drugs and shit like that. <clears throat> Since then, I watched uh, someone play it since it came out uh, the other day uh, when I'm recording this, and uh, I was like, hey, that looks like something I could really get into. So I stopped watching and bought the game and decided I would record it and whatnot. So it seemed kind of interesting. Uh, one thing that I uh, am going to do before we get into here is uh, <clears throat> I was kind of reading some reviews of some stuff and also kind of from my own experience watching the game. Uh, I think what we're going to do is we're going to try to play as much as the character, as much like the character would actually, like, act as we can. So that means we're not going to, like, just randomly go around killing everyone. We're going to try to act how the character would act and try to, like, maybe sneak around and do some more stealthy stuff like that. As opposed to just blitzkrieging everything and murdering everyone. So that way it seems like everything, story-wise, is kind of in tune with the character we've been doing. Yeah. Well, let's go. We'll just uh, go ahead and do normal, I think. Yeah. Yeah. Act one, Arthur. Happy people have not passed. Press space to continue. So I guess we can choose now. So, uh, from what I understand of this game, it takes place in an alternate universe where uh, World War II was won by the Nazis, and they've taken over England pretty much, and we, we're in England right now. So we're in like Nazi-occupied England, but uh, they've kind of made. Well, I, I think we'll get into that later. So that's that's kind of the. I'm employee of the year. Cool. Let's uh let's take our joy. I wanna see what happens. Let's just right. let's just keep working. I think this is a choice. It's not just a bottle of drug. That was the game, everyone! Yay! Alright. So that was, uh, that was the first ending we can get. 
wonder if I can skip this. No. Oh, I can hold backspace to skip. Yeah, let's do that. Remember! Pussy! Pussy! since 10 o'clock. Did you forget we're having Deirdre's birthday party? Oh. We've got a pinata. Right. Brilliant. Of course. Have you forgotten your joy? <laughs> of course not. Snug as a mug on a drug. Well, come on then. Finish up. Uh, just have a few more pages. I, I, I know you're very busy. Then don't take too long to finish. Aha. The power cell's empty. Well, what will you do? I'll get a new one. Do 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 do. I'm gonna pick this up. You can you can leave now, ma'am. By the way. Uh. Censor it. The whole past here. Just the bad, sad part. Well, I expect you in the conference room presently. Don't dawdle. You don't want to miss the piñata. Um, wasn't Prudence supposed to be coming back today? I mean... Mm -hmm. Look, I ain't about to get fired, man. Drug trials. The first trials of uh, anti-melancholy medication have been qualified as success, stated Dr. Alexander Gross, acting head of the Melancholia Studies Laboratory at the Royal Victoria Hospital. The drug reduced melancholic feelings by 28 out of 30 despondent rats over a 20-day period. Despondency can be induced in rats by repeatedly giving them electric shocks. Despondent rats take up twice as long to navigate mazes. Yeah. The drug has been tested in a few volunteers, citizens who wish to apply. Yeah. I hope I did that with the light. Let's go ahead and just get that out of there. Oh, it looks like we're uh, we're done. Cool. All right. Look, I, I ain't about to get fired on my first day here. Well, not my first day, because I've been here for over a year at least. Well, I didn't Wells. In Postum Cum Garado. Guido? Oh, fuck, that thing is. It's really fucking bright. Celebration! Plans for joy anniversary! Yes, hmm. Indeed. Search small table. Nothing. There's filing cabinets. Nothing. Why is my own cabinet locked? We can close the door, because we're an outstanding member of society, you know. Do you think the canister wonders what life's like outside the tube? Of course, he'd have to break the tube to get out. Well, that would break it for everybody. Clyde. The earth whistle. See. Oh look, Miss Bing has written Clive a letter. Dear Mr. Birchwhistle, it is so thoughtful of you to suggest how best to rearrange the department, and I'm always grateful for suggestions from junior staff on how best to do my job as director. However, I am afraid that it would be destabilizing it would be destabilizing to you swap your office with that of Mr. Hastings. Fortunately, turnover in this department is high. If Prue doesn't return soon, I don't see why you couldn't have her office. In the meantime, I suggest you pop another joy and you'll feel the sunshine in your face. Whether you have a window or not. All your best. Victoria Bring, Director. Take that Clive, you little shit. And the statistics, yeah. You're for the party, aren't you? 
And now we start going rogue. <laughs> Close. Restricted area. Unauthorized personnel. No authorized personnel beyond this point. Hmm. Well, it's got a lot of power cells here on the ground. Hmm. A cricket bat, huh? He's gonna take this in case I need it. Wait, can I, like, censor stuff for him? <laughs> oh, man. We're not on our joy. Better, uh, not censor some documents. Let's see. Serve him victory meat. It's tasty. Farm workers were expectantly expected to return from Germany. Hmm. Let's censor this one. <laughs> We don't want them all to be, you know, uncensored, because that'd be a little, uh, you know... Too obvious that they were tampered with, you know. Let's see, taxi service, bleh. What? Lame, let's censor that. No one wants to read about taxi services. Like the world is under reopens thanks to heroic efforts of uh, Colonel von Stuffenberg. Any more we got? None. Approve it. I think not. All right, that's done. What's this then? Oh, wow. That little shit. He wants my view. I have a view. I didn't know, I didn't realize, because I was too busy not giving a fuck. Yeah, of course it's locked. Do I have a view? That's not even a good view. That's like, oh look, a building in half my view, and then a little bit more of like buildings, and like I got like a fourth of the sky. Now if we were on like a high rise or something, I can understand. You know? But, no, it's just... Shit. Also, that light's out. Someone should replace that. Those two are out as well. We should we should get those replaced. Whatever happened to you, Prudence? Come back. Well, shit. Coming back, are you through? But where did you go? Canada, maybe? Did anyone else, um. Are you off your joy, Pro? I mean, you too. Hmm. Was that stuff, uh. Different? I have I have a power cell. God damn it, I have one. Fine, stand up. I don't care. I don't want to do it. Nope. Oh wait, I didn't grab it from his thing. Yep, that's right. Yoink! Forgot to grab it back. My bad, my bad. Ah. And use it. Right, I know. You know what? We're gonna make it so Prue is a better worker than the other guy. So we're gonna just censor everything. Gee, the fourth one, huh? Breeder Riot. 
What is that? See the victim, Miss Anne, appears to be in a stable condition with her husband. I know where she had a condition of her baby, whose birth was not expected for another two months. Dangerous for women who are in a family who family way to strut their condition about. Probably it sets people off when decent folk are doing their best to forget. Oh. I guess they don't like pregnant women? Flaunting they're pregnant? Or something, I don't know. Anyway, yoink! And up we go. Also very, very um scratched off right there. And this is the real world right here. We're gonna keep going. You didn't see nothing? Nope. He seemed to be a bit behind in our work now that you mention it. Huh, so we are. He's gonna come after me? Be afraid of your joy. Why don't they charge you for joy? Kind of a dick move, right? They require you take it and then they charge you for it, you know? I'm like, at least a minimum amount being free would be nice, but. I'm just saying. That's how they get you. God damn. Look at all these. Yeah. Howdy, y'all. Oh, you nearly missed the pinata. It's the most adorable Spanish custom. Uncle Jack did a whole show about it. You smash it until all the sweets come out. This, uh. Come on. Hit it. Hit it. Hit it. And then the real world happens. Well, it's time to, uh... Probably a bad time to ask for that right. Get the fuck out of here. <clears throat> I got this was here, huh? Okay. C. Okay, C and control crouch, which is good. Control is a much better one to use, by the way. Oh, hi, guys! Ow! Stairs! Fucking uppers, man. Run, boy, run! You smell gas? Flame and Nora. Forget him, there's no time! And that's the intro! Now it's generating the whole uh, huge world. That makes it an open world. Can I open this door, though? 
Let me go down that way. They are pushes people? Okay. Oh, those are stealth icons at the top there. Okay, so I can... I can go down here. I think that's the way it wants me to go, though. What if we go back this way? Sealed those off as well. Seem to have locked me in. I suppose they were worried about the gas. Terribly fearful of them. Okay. And the pile of coins. An old desk with uh, nothing in it. What do you see, huh? Parts storage? No, lavatories. <clears throat> Someone just freak out? Let's go ahead and just drink from the tap here, shall we? Alright, looks like we uh, have some survival stuff at the top there. We got our health. And we got our hydration. So what is this? A diary of Prudence Holmes. Feel free to read this on your own here. And then there's the handwritten letter. Hmm. And then this one. And then that one. Oh, this is actually kind of lore here. So, well, Arthur, you've gone and done it now, haven't you? Not only, rather, spectacularly quit your job, but you're a downer now. The townsfolk will unleash the hounds, or they would if we hadn't eaten them 20 years ago. The wastrels don't seem terribly friendly. I hope they aren't any cannibals. <laughs> oh, God, I'm one of them now, aren't I? I've got to get out of Wellington Wells. Got to get over the bridge and off the island, which means I've got to get back to the parade district, don't I? Which I was just chased out of. Brilliant. Question. What in dog's name were you thinking? Answer. Perry. Percy. What the fuck his name is. I saw his picture. Just before we... Put them all on the train. God. Horrible grinding steel. The screams. He must hate me. Why did I tell the Jerrys I was already 13? They were off by 10 days. Why didn't I keep my mouth shut and get on the train and... Go off to Germany with him like I promised him. I can't remember, but I promised him. Gotta mean something. I've got to find Perry, wherever he is, and make sure he's okay. P.S. How long have we been eating rats? Prudence really did run off. She ran this way. I wonder if I'll see you again. Ah. Dirty bandages. Yes, let's search the toilets. Wakey in scribbles, okay. How about the other area over here? Oops, not sit. Damn it. Ooh, Bobby Pins. Tie a string has been added to your journal, huh? Nice pinup, by the way. <clears throat> no more radio. Not allowed. Sovereign. Don't know what the sovereign is. Search fridge. Rupert Underhill memo. Okay. Hmm. A string. Hmm. Point tools away from you. Need. Okay. Yes. Well, I got a bobby pin. I'm assuming I can possibly pick this lock. 
need some bolts and bobs and bits of metal to make a lockpick. Let me craft things in the menu here. Cool. That's my objective, so... Let's go to this one, I guess? Yeah. Dirty bandages. We got a proper suit. We got a jimmy bar and some metal bits. It's a whole space to craft. I'll make two. Yeah. Then I can make uh, at least Jolly Bolly, which is uh, going to be a weapon, I guess. Mm. Indeed. Cool. There we go. All right, Three and... years of the salamander and me getting into constant trouble finally pay off. Let's pick the lock. All right. I wonder if I can, like, break the lock picks or if I just use them up. What happened to him? Hello there. Mother. Who? Rupert Underhill. Hmm. I'm looking at the, the face above me. So I guess like when I start looting people, people get mad, huh? Electroshocker. Also more than likely carrying dead bodies? Yep, carrying bodies does not make people happy. Syringe. Limit joy to once per hour. But I think say you can up your dosage too. Oh, looks like it's joy, like in liquid form. Ooh. I want it. Rav, are you going to hurt us? No one's going to hurt you, Percy. I, I promise. But. If they heard the city... I don't think they'll blow anything else up. Why? Because we surrendered, I hope. Well, what are we going to do, Arthur? We're brothers. I'll look out for... We'll look out for each other. Percy was his brother, okay. Percy sounds older than, uh... Older than him. Right? If you'd read this at your own pace, pause it if you have to. We've come to the end of our time. So I can sleep. Also, I can open the pneumatic stash. Huh. Okay, so I can kind of hold, or I can store stuff here. Gotcha. Two inventory. Let's move all our craft it. Oop, wrong button. Thought it said E. Move all crafting to the thing. Yeah. Electroshocker. The device opens one simple electronic lock. When the magic of smoke escapes, it's no use anymore. When the magic smoke escapes, okay. Glass bottle and lock pick. Indeed. Okay, Bobby Pins. Too bad I don't have any other hatches to go to. Unlocking to fast travel out. hatches allows you to quickly and ac safely access other areas that are hatched using the underground train tracks. You can also select any unlocked hatch from the map, no matter where you are, as long as you're not busy and be instantly magically teleported to it. Magic! Hey! <laughs> A little ding was uh nice. All right, I need a key card for that, or I can use the hacking thing, huh? There's reason the hacking thing. The magic smoke has escaped. <clears throat> okay. Hey, buddy. Put up your dukes. Put up your dukes. You want some of this? Come on, come on, pal. Black dog. What do you? What do you? 
It closes on you. Fuck you, then. Haha! -ha! That was a trick! That's the first fight I've won since primary school. Actually, I think it's the first fight I've been in since primary school. Wakey scribbles, okay. You had nothing on you? Wow. What a waste of space you are. Oh, I got a Jimmy bar. That'll come in handy. Oops. Uh, let's go ahead and pick this lock. Where's the file again? Of course it's empty. Why would it not be empty? I don't know if I should press that button. It seems like a bad button. Hello there. Huh. A rotten carrot. More rotten carrots. Indeed. Okay. Well then. Up we go. Oh, fresh carrot, huh? Can I, uh... Can I... Open this? No? That's fair, that's fair. Okay. Alright, well, let's, uh... What would be I? I don't know what the shortcut is to just, like, straight up... Enter... The crafting menu. Do I still have some of these, by the way? Do I have lock picks on me? No, they must get used up, huh? Yeah, they must get used up. Okay. I'll have to make a bunch then. Make two more. Excellent. Alright, let's uh go over here. I'm gonna open this. And yeah, we'll just move all our crafting items in here. Uh, going into the rotten stuff too. I know uh, we can actually craft stuff from the rotten stuff eventually, just not right now. A dart? A rubbish weapon unless you coat it in something? We'll store that away. Okay, let me just, uh, want to make sure that I have my actual shoes on there. Okay, I do. Excellent. Okay! Let's, um... I'm a little bit tired. Let's sleep for... Let's get the health all the way up. How about that? Oop. Sleep for 21 hours. It's fuck it. Hard day's night, that was. <sighs> oh, fuck, I'm hungry now. That makes sense, actually. Let's, uh, eat this carrot. There we go. Hunger's back up. Let's boop his button. Oh. Interesting. So I just opened up a hatch, huh? Gotcha. Excellent. Alright, well then. We can leave now. But... I want to make sure there's nothing else back here. Let's, let's grab something to drink real quick, too. There we go. I know I always get thirsty in the morning when I wake up, so... But we're going to have a little something on us. All right. All right, cool. Let's, uh... Let's go ahead and just end things here for now. And then we'll, uh... Pick up outside this and... Kind of go from there. See what's all... Go on on top side. Till next time, everyone. I'll catch you all later. Bye now.